Hi guys, it's Candace. Welcome back. So we're going to do another little quick, quick and easy play. So this is a freebie from Calico Collage. Um, it says 2022, so I'm guessing maybe last year's. But if you if you join her email list, then she has all these little little freebies in here. So this is a page that we have. So we're going to chop chop them up. Uh-huh. Chop them up and then we're just gonna jazz them up. I know, you know I love jazzing up little journal cards and stuff. So let's just chop them, chop them. Whoo, I know it got hot. It's starting to rain outside. It's been it's lightly rained all day, but it's just now like starting to rain to where you can hear it on the fireplace pipe. Ooh, I know Fergie's all ooh. I'm like girl it's just some rain. There's not really any wind. Don't know if it's coming later or not because you know her and Miss Radar ears. Oh now I know I'm doing something else with them so I need to cut this down to three and three quarters. If I'm going to play with it, I might as well just go ahead and make it for something that I'm, I know that I'm going to need. So, so I need to trim a little off the sides without getting the words. <coughs> and I know three and three quarters is what I need to fit into a pocket. <laughs> so we might as well go ahead and do it. So three and three quarters is going to put me... Like I should be there. Oh, why? Definitely misjudged on there. So he might be a little skinnier than three and three quarters just to balance it out. Because I think I was looking at the edge of the paper, not the. Whew. I know. I mean, it's like. Got warmer outside. It's so weird. This weather is just crazy. Is that supposed to get cool again? I think. I don't even know. I haven't even looked. Uh oh. I'm losing some little thingies. All right. So then I want to go ahead and round the edges because, you know, I like soft edges. So we'll go ahead and do that. Where's that? Oh, there he is. I'm like, I had a half a gingerbread. <laughs> so anyway, yes. I chopped them in half. I got two for the price of one. Just like when you get, you know, stuff in the in the in the mail. They're always broken. Or even at the grocery store, nothing's ever like full anymore. Always broken chips, cookies. All right, so we have our corners done, and let me just go ahead and lightly you know gotta lightly dust our corners so they're golden golden brown and I printed this on a hmm, hundred and ten pound or a hundred pound I don't know I it's 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 thick. It's whatever the thickest that runs through the machine, which I think is the hundred pound. Because a hundred and ten, it, it's too thick. It won't pick up. My machine won't pick it up. <sighs> All right. So. <coughs> Let's start with this one, and I cut a gingerbread man in half to go on the side. I know I did. So I used the other half on my my prototype. Oh, there he is. <coughs> so, sh oops, my shoes, <coughs> excuse me, are tied up underneath my feet. So I got a, 
a Christmas book down there that we're going to make a project with. So that's in my way. Everything's in my way. I know. All right. Let's see if I can put it on this side. Straight. And I did. All right. And then we're going to use our labels here again from the Junk Journal Studio. Whew. Man, which one do I have? It is that one. Okay, it's not the black. Which I don't know why I have blacks on here. They should be. I'm looking. Oh, that is. It's that. It's that brown. So let's just uh, cut him out. All right. Oops. And then we'll ink him. I know this is going to be quick and easy. We'll put him mm, right there. And then we're going to use our whoops. I know my cards are falling because there's no room. <laughs> I'm making a mess. All right. <laughs> then we're going to use our brown <coughs> pops of color, which is actually called Chocolate Kiss. And we're just going to, oh, I guess I'm going to follow the one, two, three, four, five. Let's tap them down to make sure our, our dots are what we want. Size wise. I know. And see, I mean, just as cute as can be, huh? There's that one. Here's this one. So that's the other side of the gingerbread man. Ta da! Oops, like that. But so we have this side and that side. So I had an accident on this one. Anyway, I'm not going to point it out. Well, there's that little one. I know. Wasn't that cute and easy? And look, look, I mean, just well. I know I've looked at it too long. Let's put some some mermaid magic on the roll and pin center. Just so it will sparkle a little more and stand out. I know we gotta have some some bling on our on one. Oh, I know this one's fighting me to close. There, okay, now I know. I don't even know if you can tell. Can you see that sparkle? Yep. Just, just a hint. Okay, so there's that one. All right, now, next. <laughs> I'm going to shoot you away. Okay, so where'd I do? Right, this one. I had another one. I don't know. Okay, so we'll do, we'll do this one. All right. So I don't need... I don't need this. We'll go ahead and close it up for now. And I guess we don't need any of these. Let me. Before it dries out. I know. Wasting time. All right. So. Boom, boom, boom. Where's my white dots? So I have some white. And I'm going to take. I'm going to put clear fingernail polish on this candy. And on the candy cane. So it stands out. Sure wish I knew what I did with the one I made. I know it's really sad, but I'm telling you. I even can get lost on this desk. And that's hard to do. Let's see if I got my edges enough. I 
think I need a little more on the edge. All right. And then I know I need to put some of this on my Walmart list. But, you know, if you have, um, you know, that glossy accents, feel free to use that. But, I don't know. I was going to say, this is cheaper. But it doesn't warp. You know how sometimes glossy accents does? But then, it is on thicker paper, so I probably wouldn't have any problem with that. I just want my candy to shine. Ugh. Come on, I don't know why I shake it. It's not like it helps. It helps me with my frustration. <laughs> okay, I think I got it. All right, so we got a little bit on there. Let me look behind me. I mean, this is just... Oh, there he is. That's where I had him. Okay. <laughs> Just want to make sure you know i'm not thinking of anything new to do okay so we got that and that now we're going to put some white in here just to give it some dimension because you know we've got to give it a little oomph oomph and i do think i'm going to put a little sequin on there don't you know? Got little dots. And then I did bring out, I know. Ugh. My crystal sparkles from Tulip. And put a blob in the middle of that snowflake. We'll keep it out because I don't know if I'm going to use it again. And then tap it down. Like I said, when it dries, it will dry, you know, nice. Now, I think, I know I did not do this on the other one, but I'm going to do it on here. I think I need just a little, you know, some raised reds, some berries. I know, because I just, I can't let something just, just be. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, I like that much better. And then, let's see. I know, he's still lacking. I know, I really think he is. So one, one, two, oh, one, two. Well, let's go ahead and, you know, they got to, you know, kind of go together. So I'm going to put one. I know, see, now I'm just, I'm filling it up. That's what happens. <laughs> you can't stop. Once you do these, once you start putting them dots on there, those dimensional dots, whoa, you, that's it, you're toast. All right, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to leave it. So here's a, this one. Isn't it cute? And see how the fingernail polish just sh shines a little bit? So this was my inspiration. Now I've I've uninspired myself, so I need to come and put some dots. Ooh, I need to clean this top off. He's got, got some goop on there. I know. And then we'll tap him down. Oops. 
put those up so I can have a little bit of room. And then the brown dots because it, you know, needed a hair more. <laughs> Not really, but I did. And then just tap it down till you get them to spread how you want them. Oh, I know. I love them. That's really cute. I love that one. So let's set him back to dry. <coughs> Oh, that one. Ooh, sorry. <laughs> and then we have this one, which I don't think I did the prototype on here. I was thinking about it, but well, I don't think I did it. I don't see one. So we're going to do the same thing. Maybe. Oh, yeah. We're going to. Oops, gloss up our candy canes. Yeah, we were outside a little, about an hour ago, and Tootsie's down there. And I'm like, girl, I'm not coming down. It's pouring down rain. So, better make do with the hay roll that you got down there that nobody wants to eat. Because I'm not going down there in the rain. Because nothing's covered and I'm not getting wet. Oh, come on. I just want a little bit more. Okay, we got that. So I'm, I'm thinking maybe one, two, three. I know I need, it needs something. Okay, so we need some little red dots in here to go with that red up there for sure. And I have these. But I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to put them in yet. So, okay, what was I saying? Oh, red dot. So, but let's go and put just two little. Little dots in here. Oh, we'll put them on the, on that dot too. All right. And we'll tap that down real quick just to see what that looks like. Okay. Then, I know I'm debating, do I want to put something on that? But no, because that's there. But I do want Ooh, I almost mushed that too much. I do want that on here. So let's get I know tomorrow I'm going to order some more of these, these little things. I found them on Timu, those round plastic things. So I think tomorrow I will order some. All right. So there's that. And then I do want to just put a large brown down here. Because like I said, I don't know what I'm tucking it in. So let me hit that heart, you know, hit that good so it spreads good. All right. And then we're going to come in and put, whoops, timber. Put some little red berries in. One, two, three. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Six. I know we're gonna have seven. Got to be. Oh, but see, 
just that little bit of red pulled it out, didn't it? Oh, so I think I'm going to stop. Well, I know I say that. But I know now maybe I want some of my icing raised. So let's just see if we can come put. Oh, ooh, that was almost too much. So I'm putting one like every other one it's looking like. Just to put a little more in there. A little more texture. And put one on top. What the heck? All right, and then we'll tap it down again. All right. Oh. And look, isn't that cute? And see the candy canes are shining. So I'm happy with that one. And then that leaves me with this one, our gingerbread, whatever that is, hot chocolate stuff. All right, so now I want to squeak like a mouse. I want to paint with my mermaid on here so that's sparkly and it jumps out a little better. I know I'm going to be fighting it. I can feel it. It's sticking to the sides. You know, I don't know if you can add something to here to loosen it up. Oh, there's a, a ball bearing in there. <laughs> First, I thought it was a dead Asian beetle, but no, it's a ball bearing. Well, I'll be darned. I never knew that. I guess that's what helps shake up the glitter. All right, so we got that. And then, since the bow is the same color as the cup, I'm using some clear nail polish to help the red show up more help it jump off the page Oop, better turn around so i can get my big edge on the edge i don't know if that makes whatever Y'all see what I'm doing. I'm painting. I'm trying to stay in the lines the best I can. Trust me, they're not in the lines. It's just wherever it goes is kind of where it goes. And if I just happen to go out, I use my fingernail or a pokey tool or something to help clean it up, clean it off the spot. But this one looks like it's landed fairly well. Okay, so we have that. Okay, and then I'm going to use our brown because we're tying things together. Sort of, kind of, maybe. Got that. Okay. And you know, last time I used the small one, but I think I want the medium. It came with in three different sizes in in a pack. I feel nail polish string on me. You know that spider web stuff. All right. We have that. Well, let me just go ahead and grab two of these. Because I'm waiting on my nail polish to dry a little bit because I'm putting something else on where the mermaid is. Whew. Ew, 
Nope, that's almost dry. Let's get that off there. Okay. So we have that one here. One there. And one up there. Okay. Oops, and then this one up top. So we got that. And now, itch my finger. I'm going to go ahead and put a few little red dots in here because, you know, the other ones have it. Not that we don't have enough red. But, you know, got to tie it in. Make your eye go to it. And then, where'd he go? My glitter glue gold, which, you know, that's what I pulled out earlier. I mean, they do sell this glitter glue at Walmart in the all the colors, but I just happen to have green. So I'm using my gold, and I'm putting these on these little stars just so they'll be more of a sprinkle look. And then it just, you know, stands up, stands out woo, a little more. Oh, I know. Makes you want to eat it, don't you? And then just tap a little bit because it will dry. They'll dry flatter. So there's this one. Let me put it up in your face so you can see the sparkle. I know. Oh. And here's my original one. That one but I I do like the little red dots on there so I need to come and see I, I use the little the little one down here I don't know who I like I don't know if I like the little one or the big one but oh well I got the big one on there so well oh and I did splatter on here so maybe I need to come splatter on this one too Oh, I know. Isn't that cute? Oh, all right. Let me set that over there and hopefully I won't stick my fingers in it, but let's get our paint and we do need to shake it because it, I'm telling you, this is acrylic and water because I didn't shake it the last time and my um, spots were not as bright white as I would like them to be. That's because the water settled to the top. So anyway, that just tells me that is what this is. So make your own. All right, so we just got a little bit of white on there because it needed it to blend with the rest. Oh my gosh, I can't wait till it dries. So let's put these out here so you can see the four that we did. And we did them, all four of them, in less than 30 minutes. So let's, oh no, I gotta make room for them though. Okay, so we have that one. We have this one. Let me, let me see if I'm lining them up. Yep. Okay, that one, that one. Who are you? Um, you. And you and then this little gingerbread guy half of one <laughs> and then this one but isn't that cute how we just took I know I got an extra sheet one of one sheet of these and just added a little bit to them and look what we got by just doing a little bit of jazzing up can you see oh, yeah you can see that enough just jazzing up our labels. Well, they're not labels. Um, what are those? Journal cards. Yep. So I love them. And like I said, it was really quick, fast, easy, and you they're really cute as can be. Oh my gosh, in real life. So I know another short, quick, and easy. 
a quick, quick, easy, cute, and simple. That's what they stand for. All right. Well, thanks for watching. Thanks for sharing some of your time with me. I hope you enjoyed this. And like I said, just take, you know, you see me do it all the time. Just taking some, you know, some cute little journal cards that a designer has made and just adding a little bit here and a little bit there. And, oh, I mean, you really do get something different and something so cute from, you know, just adding a little this and a little of that. So I will see you on the next video. Lots of kisses, lots of love. And like I said, thanks for sharing some of your time with me and sharing some of your day with me. So y'all have a great day and a blessed day. Bye, guys.